Um, so I put electricity through the liquid in roots and um, depending on, on how the electricity is flowing, the crystal is forming and then there's an animation software in the back uh, that checks how the crystal is forming and kind of reacts to that again. So it's actually always the material who does one step and then the, the software reacts and um, the electricity that goes through the whole thing comes out again and is put through a filter and this is, uh, this is what makes up the music in the end. So I don't think, so from my point of view, what I think about is as, as interesting is not the technical part, it's like the, the thing I have to use to achieve the, the ideas or the, um, the workings of the combination of image and sound and uh, this kind of creational process. So I never think about the technique of how to use, I rather hate it because it's a real pain and I'd really like to work more with people who really have ideas about it because for me it's always like a totally invisible enemy um, so I just have to guess what the problem is and Yeah, the Ohrwurmbeschleuniger was um, in a way very similar to, to the Roots project in the way that I use a very small space and try to, um, to use its complexity to don't understand the complexity but use it for something uh, I want. And uh, in the case of the Ohrwurmbeschleuniger, I had a, you know, it's a, it's a German based, a German language based project. Um, it stands for a catchy tune, but it's also a kind of an insect that crawls into the ear and starts to live there. And the metaphor was to, to shoot uh, some of them into each other and uh, see what happens then in the microwave field. And I had some six um, like, like phono needles that picked up the, the, the microwave uh, pattern and you could uh, kind of super collide them and, and adjust the whole process with the cooking program. But it was in, in, it's, it's very much connected to Roots because it's also got something very, you know, mixed up, chaotic. And in the end, uh, you don't know what's going to be the outcome, but you know it's going to be more or less destroyed or uh, working. You just don't know. And it kind of composes itself during the process. I mean, it's like with uh, using a microwave oven for the Ohrwurmbeschleuniger. It's like that you... That you connect music with, with junk food, for example. <laughs> it's like you can put in something very quickly, you just turn the knob and quickly something new comes out. It's like, would be the perfect uh, musical composition tool for your, for your kitchen, for example. You can uh, shape and, and model your mood in the morning, take it with you and see what happens during the day, whether it's a good one and sticks in your ear 
and accompanies you during the whole day or not. The purpose was actually to model the mood where you can perceive it all. It's not about, um, I, don't, I don't think about it as a, a huge metaphor for life, but rather as a, as a kind of an, uh, a painting that, um, a kind of a painting with other means that, that is redoing itself. And um, the sounds of what it really does, I model it so that you get the, the right, like in a, in a soundtrack for a movie, you don't Mickey Mouse what you're seeing, but you rather try to, to, to model the, the perception. But to do it in a kind of, um, in a logic way, not too, too directly connected and not too loose, but it needs to go together. I'm thinking about a few projects, like extending the, um, the approach towards roots to, to take it back to, because now I'm using it in a very spacious way, but I tried to make it rather flat and solid and connected with some other um, uh, like cell shock ideas I have and like cultural conditioning uh, metaphors. Uh, but I'm not really sure what I can make out of it. It's like I have a, an, in, in, uh, an initial impulse, but I never know what comes out in the, in the end. I use some musical uh, styles and like uh, an Austrian sculptor did in the, I think in the 19th century, like making heads, character heads, like typical characters uh, in a very basic expression. I'd like to use these musical styles and, and make some sculptures that deal with that.